Okay, so this segment of Pat's personality portraits, if I start like this, you may not think anything about it, but in the back of your mind you should, because according to my guest, I'm already sending you a message. And what is that message, body language expert Renata Monsieur? Well, the message is definitely that you're closed off to the people who want to approach you. So it's not very positive and the opposite, it's negative. People will be hesitant to approach you. It can also mean that maybe you have a backache, maybe you're cold. Body language should be really assessed for the entire person, not just one gesture isolated, but the entire person. The head, the shoulders, the arms, the legs, the sitting position, the walking position, all that makes one picture. Yeah, because if I'm cold, I may want to get warmed up. Exactly, right? exactly. I may be yes. sending you a message, hey, warm me up, baby. There you go. What was Lance Armstrong talking about? When Lance Armstrong yeah. was so successful at lying for, for so many years to so many millions of people that bought into it, uh, how was he able to successfully do that, Renata? Well, that's a big question. But what he portrays right now of himself, what concerns body language in the interview with Opa, uh, he definitely shows that he is nervous, very uncomfortable in his situation. If he does not want to talk about a topic or wants to avoid something, uh, he definitely has the body language which goes with that. He touches his face quite a bit, he not touches his nose. He made a gesture like this with a very quick micro expression. His eye twitched really, really quick. Micro expression is 1 25th of a second. But if you're trained, you see that. Um, he has movements like this, like this. He's definitely not exactly telling the truth because each time you touch your face, it is rather negative and it tends to be a body language uh, of deceit that you're not totally honest. Here's, here's an example of what I would be if somebody told me I had to pay back $7 million. My body language, <laughs> ah! Exactly, exactly. See, there's no secrets with me. Yes. <laughs> oh, by the way, by the way, that reminds me of a question that all the times that we've talked about this, I don't think I've ever asked you. You are German and French. Yes. I'm Irish. Mm -hmm. Body language difference, are there differences among the cultures? Um, they are, they are. And uh, if you travel or so, if you deal in business with people, you definitely should be aware of it. For instance, hand signals. Um, this, for instance, means peace in the States. If you turn it around, it's an insult in some of the European countries. Or the same with this. This is okay here. In Europe, in some countries, it's an insult again. So you need to be very careful. There are books with gestures oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. saying, don't do this if you're in Saudi right, Arabia. Right, exactly. Or if you show the sole of your shoe, uh, you touch the earth, which is dirty. So it's an insult to some of the Asian countries, for instance. Well, all right. So if you're watching a presidential debate and no, we're not having any f for a while, but during that whole period of time mm -hmm. when it was politics, 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 candidates uh, more than you wanted to see. You and I talked about those gestures and those signals that people were giving that you recognized as a professional in this field. But how do you remove your personal bias? If you already have a favorite candidate, mm -hmm. how do you remove your personal bias from your interpretation? Well, you have to. Uh, if you do interpret interpret body language, you really have to be neutral to what you're seeing. You can also not pass a judgment in a murder case or something like this. You just have to look at a situation and just look at the body language and kind of blank out everything else. You know, there's that Jody woman downtown oui. that has been on trial and yes. her body language has circled the earth. Everybody yes. is watching yes. Yes. her in that trial. She's accused of killing her boyfriend, not just in a second of passion, but she slit his throat, stabbed him 27 times, or is alleged to have. Mm -hmm. No, she said she did. She, she actually has admitted it, so it's okay. And she shot him in the head. Mm -hmm. When you're watching the news, 
Yes. With her on it, what do you mm -hmm. see? Well, we talked about it. Her body language is, again, uh, not an honest one. She looks into space forever, and an emotion is 8 to 12 seconds, no longer. So if you sit there with wide open eyes and you look into space mm -hmm. more than 12 seconds, you know it's fake. And it's not the real body language. She also has nervous gestures like putting her hair out of her face or, or touching her, her neck, her neck, her ears, her face. Constantly, again, touching the face, we have which very, is a sign. We have very few violent murderers mm -hmm. watching this program right now. <laughs> However, we have a lot of people who would like to be hired because they're unemployed or they're changing jobs. Yeah. So finally, before we run out of time, give me just a couple of suggestions. Body language, first impression, mm -hmm. meeting a potential boss. Okay, first impression is about one minute and you make up your mind who you have in front of you. So if I come in and I impress you and you think, oh, nice person, that's wonderful. If it's a bad ex expression or bad impression, then it will last forever. Good impression, you walk in straight, you walk in erect, you have a good handshake, firm handshake, you look into somebody's eyes, you sit up straight when you're talking about something or sharing a paper or contract, you're leaning forward a little bit, you have your hands open, your feet are on the ground straight, not behind you and mm -hmm. not under the chair. Usually whatever body part is behind or under you, is negative. She knows what she's talking about. She's a professional at body language. She's Renata Vissou, and if you don't know how to spell that or get in touch with her, we got that information too for you. On Pat's personality portrait, watch this for body language. Hi, baby. Come here often. <laughs>